Hi everyone, I'm Ellie, founder of Code of the Future, and in today's video I'm going to be continuing with the matplotlib tutorial series for beginners in Python by showing you how you can plot more than one graph on a plot in matplotlib. So as usual, I'll put my glasses on and I'll move you onto the screen. Okay cool, so we are continuing with where we left off on the previous video on this tutorial series. If this is the first video you've watched on this tutorial series, then all these different things on here is what you can get, be getting up to so I'd recommend checking out those videos if you're interested but for today I'm going to be showing you how, you how you can plot more than one graph on a plot. So what I've started with is I've started with an x and a y variable, both arrays. We plot them and then we'll show it and then similarly we'll do the same again but for two different variables with different arrays. And just before I do so I'm just going to comment out this previous plot that we did just so it doesn't interfere with anything that we've done. So I will just just plot just hashtag that out perfect so watch what happens i'm going to run this python file as before and we're going to plot these two plots so we've got a very standard plot here it's plotted this these first two arrays so 0 0 10 1 100 2 as you can see by these plot points here then when i cross off this particular graph it will give me a new graph now this is figure one and and this is exactly what we see by this second arrays here by these second arrays so you may be thinking well i want to plot those two these two lines so this here and these here on the same plot how do i do that now the very easy way that you can do it is by simply getting rid of this plt.show so what's important to mention is essentially whatever you write before this plt.show it will always plot on the same plot so for example if i now run this python file watch what happens amazing look at that it's plotted two different plots on the same plot it's plotted two different graphs on the same plot so this is our first one and this is our second one essentially the more lines you add the different colors they will be so if i was to add a completely new one okay let's 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 add a new one let's add it into here so we'll do another one here we'll call it r and t r and s R and S here, we'll change that to 50, change that to 46 and we'll change that to 10. Okay, now let's run. So what we've got here is we've got three different lines. So this is a plot, we're asking it to plot it. Here's another line asking it to plot it. Here's another line asking it to plot it. And then finally we're asking Python to show it. So matplotlib is gonna show it. So we run this and hopefully we'll have three different lines. There we go. That one's a little bit uh, interesting. It goes back on itself. But there you go, we've got three different lines. How cool is that? So essentially, all you need to remember is to just get rid of the plt.show. Essentially, any plot you want to be on its own, put a plt.show, Python will then show that plot. You can move on, code some more and replot. So, you know, if I was to just put a plt.plot in here, put that plt.show, that's going to be a show, apologies, show in here. It's the plt.show it. I meant the plt.show, just, just to clarify. So we've added the plt.show in there. And now when we rerun these graphs, they're all on individual sections. They're all blue because they're all individual graphs. So that is how you plot more than one graph on a plot. And I'll just say here, three plots. And we'll just get rid of plt.show. I'll just completely get rid of it. Completely get rid of it there. And have the final plt.show we'll run it amazing and just for the fun of this video i'm gonna comment back in this one that i previously did so this was a bit fancier so we'll comment that back in run it and let's see what happens amazing look at that one i think the uh, the coordinates for that one were a little bit different yeah they were awesome so that's how you plot different graphs on the same plot really really handy when you do go to do some data analysis and interpreting plots really really handy when you do go on to do some data analysis so that has been the video today i really hope you enjoyed it if you want to support this channel even further then hit the subscribe button and the bell notification with it so you don't miss out on any future videos on my channel and also check out the donation page that is in the description of this video if you could give this video a big thumbs up i'd really appreciate it and comment any questions you have in the comment section below and i'll try my best to answer if not there'll be someone out there that will hopefully answer your query thank you for watching and i'll see you all in the next video